So what, uh, what kind of lasagna is it? Uh, we have two, vegetarian and a meat. Wow. So uh, which one do you recommend? Either one. <laughs> I, I'm not real fond of vegetarian anything. Mm -hmm. I mean, if everybody was vegetarian, I'd quit and cook. <laughs> okay, no offense to vegetarians, but I'm a rather carnivorous man. <laughs> Why? Well, it's my living. We got to see like the nice sunset and, and dusk. And then it was about time to just call, call it quits and find a place to crash. At this point, we're um, at least two hours up this mountain. We're definitely not coming back down. We need some food, a place to stay, and some booze. Finally, after an hour and a half, find uh, you know, a little deli type place. We asked him, like, where can we stay? Like, where, where, where's there a place where we can crash? And uh, the woman behind the counter was kind of like, well, you know, there's this place and there's that place. And this guy comes out from the back room. Just came out of nowhere. I wasn't even in the conversation. And he's like, you guys you go up to this place it's like four miles up the road there's a bunch of hot foreign girls there a bar there and like there's always like these really hot chicks there because a bunch of foreign people go there so in my mind i'm thinking like yeah hot australian bartender here i come this uh this isn't really what i was thinking every murder, like teen murder movie in history was filmed at this place. We could definitely go fishing. <laughs> I was hoping for a fire point. You know what we need to do? We need to go get go get bombed at the bar. <laughs> it's a window. It's not a bar. It looks like a pickup window. <laughs> And on the top of the sign it says bar. There's a bunch of people around. A couple of German guys. There's the foreign people. This is exactly what he was talking about. And I'm thinking like maybe we'll kind of mingle and talk to people and get to know some locals. And it just looked like we walked into some sort of cult. A combination between salute your shorts and a retirement home. Nobody talked. Everyone kind of just walked around with their head down like... Mm. Like, I was expecting to come around the turn and see donkey lips, like, staring me in the face. So there's people playing foosball, and, you know, there's a, a salad bar and a kitchen. So there's the two Germans making sandwiches. Apparently there's a cook. I am a rather carnivorous man. But uh, they weren't cooking while we were there, so we just kind of dove right in and started making ourselves sandwiches. It's like summer camp, you know, but old. <laughs> <laughs> it was bizarre. <laughs> there is no way. There is no way. I mean, the crack of dawn, like, I don't know, like 5 30 or 2 o'clock, some crazy shit like that. No way I'm getting up and going skating right now. Come, baby, come. It's so easy when you're used to it. Come, baby, come. It's so easy when you're used to it. Dumb, baby, dumb. If it's on your tongue, you're chewing it. I 
hang it tight a little bit. Once in your life, you got sick, but it didn't change your mind. Twice, didn't like it, but your mama told you it was monkey. And you came down cause you thought it was funny. Mama told you it was monkey, but baby, it's not funny anymore. So come, baby, come, take my hand and we are through with it.